the seals! Yay, the We're seals! We're going to look exactly the same as we always look when we come here. Hi everybody, excuse the hat here. We have just got to our um, B and B in Marazion, and I thought I'd give you a quick room tour. It is now about four o'clock on Thursday, so yeah, we're here for two nights before we go into our apartment for the week. So let's give you a tour. Let's start over by the door. We've been here before, but this is um, a, a room that we've never stayed in. A really nice light over this side. The other room only has one small window that we usually stay in, doesn't it? Yeah. And my bouquet is still alive, people. Bouquet update, it's still alive. Yay. Yeah, and a really nice dressing table. And then we have the bed. All of our stuff. We have so much stuff. <laughs> Don't we? we do. There's an awesome view out the window. We'll come to that in a minute. This bathroom, which is pretty, pretty nice. Me, which looks messy. And yeah, a little um, dressing table. And yeah, this is the view, which is the most important part here. And over there, I don't know if I can... Where is it? <laughs> it's gone. Good God, it's gone. You're not actually going to be able to see because it's too far around the corner with St Michael's Mount. But anyway, we'll show you that later. So right now, we are going to try and stop this look happening. <laughs> and we're going to just chill for a bit and probably have a cup of tea. And then we might have a walk on the beach. But I fell asleep in the car earlier. We pulled over in a like a really nice view next to Gadrivi and I fell asleep for a bit while Joe just sat there patiently waiting for me to wake up and then we went to Marks and Sparks and we got ourselves a little picnic for tonight for dinner. Saturday the 4th of April, we've been AWOL. <laughs> I basically vlogged us going into our B&B room and that was about it, but when we went to St Michael's Mount yesterday, it was peeing it down with rain and I didn't want to take my camera in the rain and the wind because it would have just been a disaster. So I shall insert some photos of our day. Anyway, so now it is Saturday morning and we are going into our apartment in Carbis Bay for a week and we can't get into the two, so we are right now on our way to Senon, which is where we went out for dinner on our wedding night. Um, we're going to have a little walk on the beach, we've got a couple of hours to kill before we head to Carbis Bay, so we're going to have a walk on the beach and possibly stop for a coffee slash tea. And yeah, and then we are going to head off to Carpus Bay. So I will do some filming today, um, but it has been nice to have a couple of days that's just been about us and not about vlogging. Not that I don't want to share it with you guys, but you know, sometimes you just gotta switch off for a little bit. But also on a side note, Cornwall water. <laughs> Cornwall water makes my hair the shiniest that it's ever been in my entire life. Just thought I'd mention that, considering all I try and do is buy products that make my hair shiny. What I have to actually do is move to Cornwall, so there's another reason why we should move to Cornwall. Yeah. Anyway, so right now we're on the road that goes all the way to Land's End, let me show you.
yeah so this road goes all the way to land's end and uh if you keep going you'll just drop off the edge but we're not going to do that Our balcony this morning. It's Easter Sunday, and we are about to go on a walk over to over there, which is St Ives, through the coastal path. It's about two miles each way, and uh, yeah, that's what we're doing this morning. So it's a bit late now. It's about 11, so we're heading out, and um, it's a really, really nice day out there today. So we thought we'd go for a walk. Um, I haven't shown you our apartment yet. It's a bit of a mess. Um, so I may give you a tour at some other time, but it's a really, really nice, big apartment, it's got a kitchen, and the view is stunning from the lounge and the bedroom, it's out to the coast. We're in Carvis Bay, and uh, yeah, it's amazing. So today's plan is to go for this walk, burn off a few calories, because we've eaten quite a lot since we've been in Cornwall, and then later on today we're meeting up with some friends who are also in Cornwall on their holiday, um, so we're meeting up with them for some early dinner and then we'll come back here, I've got to edit some stuff and do a blog post and yeah that's about it for today, not a bad Sunday and I will insert some footage of our coastal walk right now. So we are staying in one of those apartments up there and about to embark on our coastal walk. There's the hubby. Hello. Good morning. And then this is Carbus Bay. It's so calm out there today, it's unreal. We are heading over to Stives. Some ice over there. Let's go. Stage one stop of the coastal path. Wowzers. Look at that view all over to Bajili. Deep. Here we go, up the hill of doom. Mount the hill, up the hill of doom. Up Mount da, da, da. doom. It's almost as tall as Mount Doom. Wherever Mount Doom is. It's in the Lord of the Rings. Oh. You know. Okay. Geeky reference That's there. Cool. We're going to go home, we're going to put the kettle on, and we're going to have a cup of tea on our little balcony, even though the sun has decided to go in. But it still looks like this, which is pretty bloody amazing, nonetheless. But literally every man and his dog was in St Ives today so we didn't last very long here we go it doesn't look that steep on camera <laughs> it's steep people it's steep it's a little bit mental Ooh. oh he's down <laughs> that's got to be pretty tough Good morning, it is Tuesday the 7th of March, probably been AWOL for maybe a day or two but we uh, went out yesterday with some friends for lunch and uh, had a good day in the sun, the weather was 
amazing yesterday it was like summer and I think it's going to be pretty similar today with a few clouds about but we thought we'd vlog today because we we're off for a walk from Senin to Land's End and then we're going to go to Cape Formal which I know we've vlogged before but it's always so lovely and uh, you know this is also for us as well as for you so we'll vlog it again but right now we're on our favourite road um, in Cornwall which we call Magic Road I don't actually know what this road is called do you? B3306. It's the B3306, otherwise known as Magic Road. And the reason we call it that is because it runs all the way along the coast between St Ives and Land's End, or St Just, it kind of finishes, doesn't it? Yeah. St Just. Um, but it's just stunning, and we'll take some footage because we're going to pull over a couple of times. But it's quite a long way to go to get to where we're going, but it's worth it. First stop on Magic Road. It's a bit windy and it's a bit chilly. We stopped at the tin mine. Other than the wind, you can't really hear anything here. We are arriving at the beginning of our oops, the beginning of our walk. Gosh, I can't even hold this straight. So we're going to walk from here over the hill, over there. Oops, with my finger, over there towards Land's End and back again. <laughs> Any luck? Benches. I'm kind of obsessed with them, especially ones by the beach. Well, only really ones by the beach. But I'm going to try and zoom in. Oops, there we go. That's, I'm going to try and sit as still as possible. That's Longship's Lighthouse. And uh, they occasionally land helicopters on top of that to maintain it and stuff, but that's pretty darn amazing right there. Look at that. Wow. Is there a door at the bottom of that white bit? Yeah, there is. Wow. I can tell you that's something right at it right here. I think we're one of the first people in here. There might be a few people in, but we chose to do it first because it's bloody hot in here and it gets really, really busy.
very, very humid in here, guys. Very, very, very humid. I'm here to tell you. Hence the hair is up. Came fully prepared this time with thinner clothes on and no coat. Because last time we had to carry coats around. But hey, this is what we're looking at. It's pretty damn amazing. And it just gets more and more humid the higher you get. And actually to take a deep breath in is quite hot, isn't it? Yeah, it's very, very, very humid. We should go on the Skywire thing, but I think it's expensive. It's about 80 pounds. And uh, possibly we should have a dinner Yeah, I think so. When it could be spent in the gift shop. Um, it's fine. But anyway, it's fine by me. But we, we decided we'd both definitely do it. Though. We've now got annual passes to the Eden project, so, so maybe next time. Yeah, I definitely. Maybe next time. But it's just too much money. We've got 36 quid for us both to do it. It's, it's way too much, really. But still, it's fun to watch people do it. <laughs> Morning, all. Afternoon or afternoon. It's Thursday, the 9th of April, and it's 1.22 and we are just going out because we had a lay-in and had a bit of a lazy start, but now we have the rest of the day ahead of us. Um, we're off to a different beach today, which is near Godrivi, where we go to see the seals. And um, we have never been there before, but it's kind of like a sand duny is that a word? <laughs> a sand duny kind of beach. The weather is absolutely out of this world. As we drive up this road, lots of people are walking down the road to Carbis Bay Beach looking um, <laughs> and we're going to try and find something to eat because we've just had a bit of breakfast but we have nothing in the house for lunch so we're going to go off and see this new beach and if there's nothing to eat there we are going to go to Godrivi, have something to eat maybe walk up and see the seals again but we've got to make the most of this weather because I think tomorrow's going to turn I'm not quite sure what we're going to do tomorrow and um, yeah, let's go to the beach Oh yes! So we found the dunes well, this isn't really a dune, is it? It's just like a mini, a mini dune. It's a hill of sand. So we're just trying to get to the beach because everywhere we walk seems to go away from the beach. But that is the beach down there. Oops. And we are staying over. over I can't even see where I'm pointing on this camera because the sun's in the way. Over not that beach, but the second one in. That's where we're staying. So we're heading down there. Let's go down here. Get over there. 